So like the reality of trying to be the most ethical hunter is that, you know, you have an obligation to find the animal that you've shot. You need a partner that's going to extremely quickly get into the right area to be totally engaged, to be watching, that can swim, that can jump, that can, you know, run down birds and then has an unbelievable nose. He, that's his time to hunt, right? So we think we're hunting, but there's that moment when he, when he gets to do his hunting and that's an exceptional moment really. It's so important to have a trainable dog. And the reality is that you need him to like incorporate into your life, right? I mean, maybe, I, maybe I'm not a hunter. Maybe there's something else that I'm really interested in. But the reality is that Odin, he would rise to any occasion. I mean, I put him in a lot of different scenarios and he, his like top desire is to please and to like be with us, a part of our pack. Odin! And so, He's wanting to do his part in whatever that looks like. Odin! Good boy, good Odin. Come on. We basically timed it when we, uh, my wife and I had our daughter, and so we brought Odin into our family about the same time so that they would like always know of each other. Ever since then, I mean, Odin is, uh, he's an inside dog, right? And so he physically is around us. Uh, we take him to the office with us. He's also uh, on our, like, <laughs> on our team. Uh, our lifestyle um, just revolves around a lot of outdoor activities, and so, um, you know, he's involved obviously on the duck hunting side, but we do a lot of outdoor, outdoor activities, and so he comes along for all those activities. He's fully integrated into our lives. Um, it's a special relationship. Uh, we've had dogs before, but not a dog that's truly had like such a bond with our family and just, you know, he's just a part of every aspect of what we do, you know. My name is Doak Duncan, and I'm from College Station, Texas. Yeah, so these are our Wagyu cows here. Let's see, we've got our calves back there. <clears throat> on our properties that we hunt on, uh, you know, we also run cattle, so uh, kind of dual purpose properties, I guess. So yeah, Odin will come along with me and we'll ride around and check everybody and Odin's always down to ride around. I mean, I've been around doodles. Um, I've got friends that have doodles um, and, um, you know, they are cute, they are fun, they are fun fluffy dogs, but I wouldn't say that I've really ever met one that like I thought could become more, you know, become more of like a hunting dog or really just you know, have like a more elevated dog experience. I mean, off the cuff, a lot of people have a preconceived notion on what a poodle or a doodle is. That's just not the reality. I mean, when I tell people that Odin is a hunting dog, uh, that he's a duck dog specifically, you can see they've got like this kind of, you know, they've got all these thoughts that they've had in their whole life about what, you know, hunting dog should be. But then they've got like the reality of like a dog that doesn't shed, you know, and that their like family would really love, you know, and you can like see this kind of duality like play out when I talk to them. And, and I mean, by the end of it, they're always asking like, where'd you get him? You know, uh, what's the story? And, uh, and they're just loving on him. I just think that like American Hunting Doodles has the right objective and the right goal. I mean, it's not an inexpensive dog. You're not like going to them to get, you know, you're not looking for a bargain, but you're, you're getting such a, a quality of dog that like the reality of what the price of a dog like this and the experience and the end result, I mean, 
in some ways, it's all it's, it is a bargain <laughs> for like what how much my life is impacted every day by this animal, and it's going to be like this for years. I mean, in some ways, you know, it should be. 10 times that amount of money. I mean, if you think about it over the life of the dog, I mean, it's, it's really unbelievable.